Roman Rite, I just wanted to do a video just showing you the absolute perversion that goes on inside Roman Catholicism. You go on Google and search up Catholic priest sex abuse, and search up, go to the, um, I use, Duck, I use DuckDuckGo, I don't use Google Chrome. Uh, DuckDuckGo is more private, basically. It's, uh, it protects your personal information, and you can access the deep web, too, so that pretty much that helps in research. But go to past month, let me search it up, and uh, you're going to see how pretty much almost each week there's like a new story coming. Oh, look at that. You know, nine days ago, one day ago, one day ago. I mean, almost each week there's like a new story coming out. You know, uh, October 23rd, 2019. You know, October 23rd, 2019. October 15th. October uh, 30th. You know, six days ago. Uh, October 23rd, October 31st. I mean, just on and on and on. I mean, Roman Catholicism is... The system of the Antichrist. It's the mother of harlots and abominations of the earth. Let me show you the scriptures of that. Uh, Revelation chapter 17. Here it is. Revelation 17 verse 5. And upon her, her forehead was the name written, Mystery Babylon the Great, the mother of harlots and abominations of the earth. You see, the Roman Catholic Church is filled with pedophilia and filled with sex perverts like sodomites and other freaks like that. It's rampant with it. I mean, look, October 23rd, you know, 166 children abused by 43 priests in Colorado. Colorado you know, and you want to say this is Christ Church. You know, uh, October 25th, you know, uh, October 25th, and they just go on on February 22nd. All from, This is all from 2019, by the way. Uh, August 5th, July 10th. I mean, come on, it just, it just goes on and on and on. September 13th, you know. 12 cases of Catholic sex, sex clergy to local and whatever. Uh, April, April 25th, after list of South Carolina priests accused of abuse and, you know, go down. Uh, 75 new lawsuits over child abuse, July 24th, 2019. Bishop accountabilities where you can track uh, Catholic sex abuse. I mean, Roman Catholicism is truly the mother of all, of all harlots, and the mother of harlots and abominations of the earth, sorry, in Revelation 17. I mean, this is not Christ Church. This is a pagan Babylonian cult. Uh, priest of sexual, you know, October 13th, August 19th, a priest accused of sex abuse while well, pastor of Portville's Sacred Heart. Yeah, they're not pastors. Um, and these uh, priests are, you know, wicked. I mean, just I can just go on and on. Look at all this. I mean, just on. I mean, this is the corrupt fruit that comes out of Roman Catholicism. I mean, just on and on. I mean, pretty much like again, like each, almost like each day, almost each week, there's like a new story coming out about some pervert. You know, November November fifteenth, twenty eighteen, Catholic priest accused of sexual abuse named. You know, seventeen Jesuit priests tied to St. Louis named on a sexual abuse list. Hmm, Jesuit priests. Why am I not surprised? The Jesuit order is just very, very wicked, very, very satanic. Um, actually, let me just. Open that in a new tab, so I, because I might want to save this as a PDF. Because uh, whenever I come across articles like these, I do try to save them as PDFs. So, you know, okay, I'm just going to X out of that. 17 Jesuit priests tied to St. Louis named on sexual abuse list. Jesuit, you know, the Jesuits, if you don't know who they are, they're a very, very wicked uh, military order in the Roman Catholic Church. They are the ones that run the entire world. Wyoming Diocese, 11 former clergy accused of sexual abuse. That one, that new tab. I mean, just on and on and on. I mean, just each week, you know. November 29, 2018. Uh, just go down some more. But you guys get, you, I mean, you get the picture. October 16, 2019. I mean, you get the picture. Roman Catholicism is rampant with pedophilia. I mean, this isn't just a couple of priests, you know, a couple instances. I mean, again, each week there's like some new story coming out. I mean, look at this. All just like, and these are all within like the past couple of months. It's crazy. So, yeah, if you think that Roman Catholicism is Christianity, you're terribly deceived. Uh, Roman Catholicism has nothing to do with Christianity. Again, you know, Reve if you compare Revelation 17, about uh, I've done I've done a video showing that Revelation 17 lines up with Roman Catholicism. Uh, if you want, I mean, um, I think I had a picture of that. I forget where it was, but I've done videos proving that when it talks about you know purple and scarlet, you know the purple and red robes the cardinals and bishops wear. You know, decked in gold and precious stones and pearls, go to the Vatican. It's covered in in gold and jewels and stuff, full of abomination, uh, full of abominations and filthiness of our fornication. Look at the popes of the past. I mean, the popes of the past—they're fornicators. I mean, a lot of them are were like sodomite perverts and 
you know, just wicked people. You know, drunk him with the blood of the saints. I mean, that's certainly not true of Roman Catholicism. I mean, they've killed millions of true biblical Christians who didn't bow down to their pagan cult. So, um, don't be deceived by the Catholic Church. And I, I encourage you, if you're a, a true, saved Christian, do something to expose this satanic cult of Roman Catholicism. Because I believe that this sexual abuse stuff, um, like the atheists and you know the, the liberals and stuff, they're going to pin it on true biblical Christians and say, look, look at these Christians, they're abusing you know, children. I believe that the Catholic Church is being used by Satan to bring persecution upon true biblical Christians. And that's why Satan is, you know, getting these Catholic priests to get all, you know, sexually aroused and stuff. So people can blame true Christians and say, look, Christianity is full of pedophilia. No, it's not. No, it's, not. it's Catholics. Catholics are not Christians. So the Catholic Church will be used um, to bring persecution upon true biblical Christians. And then eventually during the time of Jacob's trouble, they will actually be doing the persecution themselves. I fully believe that. So if you're truly saved up there, do something to expose Roman Catholicism and do something to show that Roman Catholicism has nothing to do with Christianity. It's a pagan false cult that was started by Satan. Um, you see right there you have an atheist, you know, site, friendly atheist, patheos.org, you know, talking about these 43 Catholic priests sexually abused 166 kids. You see, atheists are, are reporting on this. They're going to use this to come and persecute us and say, look at these Christians, you know. So, yeah, again, do something to expose Catholicism. God bless you. Goodbye.